The biggest farce I've seen since Parliament opened, and with me being a member. We had a process this morning where there are no rules. They are making up the rules as we speak. If I did not allow people to know that I was going to vote no in advance, we would have gone there and there would be even more chaos. But they rushed after I made my uh, position known and put ballot papers in place. And the ballot papers only got a place to vote yes. There's no, there's no no. There's no place to put a no on the ballot paper. You, so you, they want you to part with an X or a tick. But the tick can only be for, um, to vote yes. And you normally know vote for a person by barking an X. So the whole process is wrong. There are no rules. The ballot paper itself come out of somebody's mind last night or the night before. The, something like this should be made part of the rules of, of parliament or under a rule bill of the constitution where you will have a procedure for electing the president. There is no procedure. There are no procedural rules. I can't sit down and pretend that um, I see this thing happening and, 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 and go along with it. I'm 63 years old today. You think I'm going to let people leave me in madness? Yeah. No, this, 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 this thing is absolutely wrong. And the process is that it is rushed and nobody seems to want to step back and do the right thing, you know. They, didn't amend, they, they amended the old British constitution for crying out loud and call this our Republican constitution. Is it, why, did, why couldn't they just be at a couple of months, draft something properly and, and, go, and, and go from there? No. Why, why the haste? Why the rush? Okay. Um, Prime Minister, Mia Motley's response to those same questions you would ask would, be, would have been that she is putting the driver right now in the president's position and then next year they're going to discuss. So what was your response to that? Look, there's a, that, that piecemeal approach is stupid. If you're going to become a republic, you publish a republican constitution, have a, a barbarous constitution act, and everything flows from there. You put the president in place under a British statute. The, the, our constitution is still a British statute. So, so we, we are claiming our republican status from Britain? We're getting permission from Britain. That's what it looks like. We got, we, people have to stop and think. And, and, not, and not only one person in the entire parliament thinking for everybody else. It will not happen with me. Or there will be no need for me to be there.